Sydney Grant for Good News 360. Here's how the Holy Spirit is moving around the world. The Episcopal Church kicked off its revival right here in Pittsburgh. Calvary Church in Shadyside held the first night of services. The focus of the revival is to motivate, equip, and mobilize dioceses across the denomination to engage in Jesus' work of evangelism and reconciliation. Church leaders say the movement needs to be centered on God's love so it can spill out into the entire world. Revivals will take place in six other places, including Georgia, Honduras, and England. Hundreds of Christian farmers gathered together for prayer in Switzerland. 800 men and women participated in the country's farmer conference. The event included times of prayer, worship, and networking. Farmers shared what faith in God looks like when it comes to farming. Older and younger farmers also prayed for one another as well. The Swiss Christian farmer movement has inspired similar gatherings in six other countries. Archaeologists will break ground at the site where the Ark of the Covenant stood. Israeli and French researchers plan to excavate a place outside Jerusalem. The site is one of the few remaining biblical sites that is yet to be studied. Organizers hope the study of Karat Yerem will shed light on the site's significance during the time of King David. The sacred site is mentioned over a dozen times in the Bible. Researchers say the area may be the only key site in Judah that hasn't undergone a systematic excavation. That's all for Good News 360. Have a great day on Purpose.